Today's topic is all about, boiler corrosion. Previously, we discussed a form of corrosion, which is infused in the metal of the boiler feed water. Likewise, now we are moving to a similar topic called, boiler corrosion. Boiler corrosion is due to the presence of, dissolved oxygen, dissolved carbon dioxide, and dissolved salts like, magnesium chloride. Dissolved oxygen. We know that, the corrosion is a natural process, which converts the metal to its oxides, sulfides, or hydroxides. So, it's clear that, the oxygen plays an important role in corrosion. When water is fed to the boiler, it contains dissolved oxygen, which is then heated, to evolve free oxygen. The evolved free oxygen, corrodes the boiler material. Let's take a look at, how dissolved carbon dioxide causes boiler corrosion. When water containing bicarbonate is heated, carbon dioxide is evolved. The evolved carbon dioxide, makes the water acidic. Carbon dioxide, when reacts with water, forms carbonic acid. The formed carbonic acid causes, corrosion in the boiler, which is called as, pitting, nothing but the localized form of corrosion. And, it is responsible for the occurrence of small holes in the boiler metal. The appearance of holes in the boiler metal, is what, pitting corrosion is all about. Dissolved Magnesium Chloride When water containing, dissolved magnesium chloride is used in the boiler. And by heating, hydrochloric acid is produced. Hydrochloric acid is a strong acid, which has the ability, to corrode metals. In the boiler feed water, hydrochloric acid attacks the boiler in a chain-like reaction, producing HCl, over and over again. So that, it corrodes the boiler severely. This chemical reaction, can prove the natural process of corrosion. So, that's all for today. Stay tuned for the next lesson.